Ladies and gentlemen, we're very honored to have Miss Sarah Benacasa, the one, the only. You've. Uh, Sarah, where do I start with you, essentially? Agora <laughs> Fabulous, the Sarah Palin vlogs, uh, working on Sirius, on Cosmo, your bathtub interview series. How does it feel to just be back here, just doing your thing, just being Sarah Benacasa tonight? I'm just really thrilled that you knew so much random shit about me. That's awesome. Like, you are Seacrestian in your knowledge. It feels good. I took the night off from work at Sirius XM, so I'm hoping the satellites don't fall down without me. I haven't heard anything yet. Yeah, I'm so. waiting. I'm waiting. I'm pretty nervous about it. But I'm stoked. I'm presenting best one-person show. Okay. To uh, someone attractive and awesome. Oh. So I'm excited about it. Very cool. Very cool. Do you have any advice for people out there? Because your your show Gore Fabulous was a huge hit when it ran here this past year and everything. Do you have any advice for anybody who's thinking about maybe putting together a one-person script of their own? My advice is to be incredibly self-centered and narcissistic, which if you're considering doing a one-person show, you probably already are, and then just go with that. That's what I did, in it, and it worked out well. I'm taking the show to Norway for a week in wow. June. Yeah, cool. I'm excited. You know, uh, just as a quick little side note, we just got done playing the North Carolina Comedy Arts Festival. Yes! And I applied to it because I knew your show was in it, too. Thank you. It was fun. Did you, did you hang out with Zach Ward and have a good time? Most deaf. Most deaf. He's a great guy. Cool. Well, Sarah, thank you so much. Wonderful to finally meet you.